Okay guys, so I've told you about the importance of the primary flight display because it has speed on it, it has attitude, it has rate of climb or descent and it also has bank angle turning left, right so you can fly the aeroplane very safely it's provided you have an accurate and working primary flight display. So what if the navigation display fails at a critical moment? It's not as critical to have the navigation display at a critical moment or a transfer of it because you've got the primary flight display. At a later stage, once the aeroplane is stable at a safe altitude, you can make a transfer to give you the information that you might want on the navigation display. So let's have a look. I'm going to fail the navigation display. At the moment, both displays are working. That is the navigation display, this one. So I'm going to fail that in a minute and see what happens. ND fail, nav display, captain side, execute, and that's what happens there. So it's blanked out. Okay? So now it's blanked out. And you see nothing's happened as far as as far as transfer, nothing has happened at all. So the captain at that stage, let's say it happened during the takeoff, the captain might say to the first officer, you have control, because the first officer still has both displays. But it's not that critical for him or her to hand over control because they still have the speed, the attitude, uh, attitude rate of climb or descent, heading. So everything is there for safe continuation of a rotation, for example. It's still very safe for the captain to continue or the first officer in any case. But once they get to a safe altitude, the captain can then go over here You've got to remember those two switches. You've got inboard CRT, which would be this one. You've got lower CRT, which would be that one. So on the CRT, lower CRT, you see it says ICAS primary or ND or normal. Normal, it shows you all the ICAS instruments. But because the captain's ND has failed, the captain can reach up here and say, lower, I want you to show me the navigation. So I'll just move that switch and see what happens. See that? Now the captain has navigation information, just like the first officer. So instead of flying with this and that, the captain is now flying with this and that for the navigation. All the information that we had here that was for the engine instruments or anything else has been moved up again to there, to a compacted display. So we can still have that information. And that is the failure of a navigation display ND. So I'll put it back to normal and restore the failure.